So we are aware of the court decision. We have discussed it with the Prime Minister, with cabinet colleagues, with senior federal government officials and experts. We respect very much Canada's independent judiciary. However, we do not agree with this decision and respectfully, we will be appealing it. I would just like to take a moment to remind Canadians of how serious the situation was in our country when we took that decision. The public safety of Canadians was under threat. Our national security, which includes our national economic security, was under threat. It was a hard decision to take. We took it very seriously after a lot of hard work, after a lot of careful deliberation. We were convinced at the time, I was convinced at the time, it was the right thing to do. It was the necessary thing to do. I remain and we remain convinced of that. And I'll now turn it over to my colleague, the Minister of Justice, and then we'll hear from my colleague, the Minister of Public Safety. Arif, over to you. Thank you. Thank you, Christia. Just to build on what uh, Minister Freeland was mentioning, uh, the uh, court decision, uh, we've received the judgment. Uh, we've done a preliminary review of the judgment. Uh, the judgment finds in certain respects that the decisions of the uh, government uh, were valid and within, were within constitutional parameters. In other respects, it finds it was not. Um, upon reviewing that decision, we obviously reiterate the respect for the judicial process that Minister Freeland has just mentioned, but a fundamental aspect of the judicial process is also proceeding on an appeal. And after that consultation with the Prime Minister, with Cabinet colleagues, we've uh, taken the decision that we, we, we will be proceeding on an appeal, as is within our rights within ju the judicial system.